We are still looking for a home church. We've been to how many, baby? Six churches. They've been cool. They're places of Jesus. You know, they love God and stuff like that from what we can see. You know, they preach the Bible. Uh, I feel like it's maybe been more than six, but we both agreed that it was about six. Um, and so here we go. We're going to go to the next church. Seventh church that we tried. I mean, hey, seven is supposed to be God's number. So here we go. We're going to give it a whirl. We're going to give it a spin, give it a shot. And uh, to be honest, you know, there's some things that, that Stephanie's looking for in a church that I'm looking for in a church. We're trying to agree on a, a home church. But I think ultimately it's just about where does God want us to be for our family to call home church. And so we're looking for a home church. It's not easy. Like we'll sit there and look, 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 look for hours. You know, we pray um, and stuff like that. Um, I don't know if it's hours. We look for hours, but look for a long time. No, I mean, all together, it's probably been a, been maybe maybe some hours, maybe. Um, I don't. I'm not sure, but I don't know. But pray for us that we find a church because this is not easy. We've we've been looking, right, babe? Yeah, so uh, we're about to get ready. We got to leave here in about less than an hour for this next church, Seventh Church. We, the one we went to when they when they were prophesying over us was dope. They called us up to read a scripture, and the Holy Spirit had me actually start preaching a 10, 13 minute message. Um, that was fire. Um, it just we loved them. It just wasn't feeling like it was like the home church. So yeah. Anyways, um, God's good. Pray for us, y'all. Okay, so we just got out of church right now, uh, probably maybe 30 minutes or an hour ago. It was the seventh church that we've been to. We were looking for a home church. And uh, what about the other churches made us feel like they weren't our home church, baby? Two of them were on screen. Two of them were on a screen. And we want an intimate church where the pastor's actually live preaching. Yeah. Um, one I liked a lot, it was Pentecostal, but it was pretty disorganized in a way. Yeah, true, it was. And then the, the children's class would start two hours in after the service, so yeah, we'll have yeah. kids running around and not really like it wouldn't let us concentrate too much. Yeah, um, what else? Um, there was the other one where it was kind of, it was a really pretty big church, but it was kind of showy. Like it felt like it was trying to be like just an entertainment piece. Mm -hmm. A lot of it was just like entertainment. And then there was also some weird vibes. I got some weird vibes from the pastor that was just like, uh, that was kind of inappropriate. I wasn't feeling the way you were talking right there. And it was a huge like, oh no, I'm not feeling that. But I was already not feeling that church. And Steph was already not too much filling that church. Yeah. But, yeah, but now this church we went to, what, what did you feel about that? This church we went to today, I felt like it was, it was nice. It was a smaller church. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, not too much um, people. Yeah. You know, yeah. there is people, but not it's not super crowded like other churches like Christ Fellowship. That I attended for almost seven years. Which the pastor is, is good over there. Amazing they got pastor. Awesome worship team and stuff over there. Yeah, but it's again, it's on the screen. Yeah. You know, and Taylor didn't like it too much there, like that. So, but this church was pretty good. The preaching was was amazing. Yeah, it was fire. The it was preaching really good. was amazing. The pastor had a personality. Um, he was being silly. He was showing visuals with the screen, with a little bit of acting. So it was good. We liked it, right? Yeah, it was cool. Um, <clears throat> I, yeah, I liked it because there was nothing overly weird about it. Obviously, there's not going to be any quote unquote perfect church or whatever until heaven, right? Yeah. But um, yeah, I liked it that um, it was, um, like I said, there was nothing overly weird about it. You know, all the churches that we tried were Christian churches. This is a Christian church. Um, when we came in, um, there's nothing overly, uh, like over the top weird about it or like anything like that. But, um, the people were about our age, right? Yeah. A lot of the people were about our age. It was a, a decent place for, to put the baby, um, to, to hang out during, during church. And then 
Worship was pretty good. We did communion um, <clears throat> at the beginning. And then, yeah, the pastor was just was just preaching fire. And uh, and it just felt like a place where it's like, oh, I could see us here. I could see us growing here. I could see us growing here. Um, obviously, we feel called to pastor a church one day. And the couple uh, who is the pastor and the pastor's wife, it's a little bit older than us. They're obviously um, pastoring this church. And so it's like, okay, we can, we can, we can learn here. We can grow here. Right? Yeah. Yeah. And it's basically like a new church. It's a new church. Mm -hmm. It started a while ago, mm -hmm. you know, so everything's brand new. Yeah. It's good. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's good. And then they preached the vision today. I think we could kind of find beauty in the vision of the church. They were talking about, um, you know, how, how, uh, how they want to, uh, grow this year in 2024 we want to keep the faith in 2024 and and different things along those lines so um also the preaching was on point yeah yeah it was on point so it was really good it was really good preaching yeah it was it was and i felt like as soon as i walked in the place i felt like it was anointed mm -hmm. i felt i felt the holy spirit as soon as i walked in not only did i feel the holy spirit but i heard the holy spirit speak to me twice yeah during worship yeah, and God gave me a vision in the spirit, a very personal vision uh, <clears throat> um, of my marriage in the in the spirit, and uh, that was that was that was nice. And then God was giving me a little bit of visions about what this church might be for us in this season. Um, and so that we got to speak with the pastor a little bit. It was Pastor Bennett. Like I said, he's probably a little bit older than than us. Yeah, a tiny bit. Yeah. Um, um, Got to speak with him a little bit after church, you know, swap numbers and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Um, and so yeah, I think for now this might be it. What do you think, babe? I think we will go back a few times, yeah, and we'll continue to pray and let God guide. Amen. Um, but for now, I think we are content with this church. Not saying it's home church, but... Pastor Jim said that, too. Like, go a few times. That's yeah. What he said. But so far, we That's like good. it. We I like both that. agreed on everything. That's wisdom, what you're saying right now. I like that. My son was happy there, and I think we're happy, too. Praise God. Well, so we're looking for home church. If you guys believe in Jesus Christ, man, I believe God wants you to be connected to a local body, local church. And obviously, you know, I'm out here in Florida. The Lord let me out here with my wife. I've been out here for six months. We've been trying to find churches where the Lord wants us to be yeah. um, a part of. And so, and we feel like maybe God wants us here. You know, there's gonna, not going to be any perfect church. Obviously, we're not expecting, you know, it to be heaven on earth. But, you know, just a place where God wants us to be, to, to grow in, in our calling and to grow in our walk with the Lord and, and just, uh, you know, attend uh, with the Christian community. So we're just going to let the Lord continue to lead. And we pray the blood of Jesus Christ over you guys, that you guys either find a church or that you guys continue to serve in the church where the Lord has you. Yeah. In Jesus name. Y'all be blessed.